What's up, world? It's your boy Josh Lamont, Theme Music Productions, ThemeMusicPro.com, the instrumental provider. Tonight, I'm just gonna talk about, uh, just give a look, couple of tips to my fellow producers out there. A um, couple of tips on how to become a more successful music producer. Um, I know this journey could be real hard. You know, we're gonna go through some trials and tribulations just to get this shit right. So, um, I'm gonna give you a couple of tips of you know what I do or what I practice you know to help me get where I need to go and shit like that if they work for me I'm pretty sure they can work for you you just gotta apply it you know what I'm saying all I, all I do is tell you what I know you know what I mean so check it out alright first first things first you wanna know what success is your definition of success could be way different from mine so define what your definition of success is you know what I'm saying you want to know where you where you're going, where you're aiming at. You know what I mean? Maybe you want to work in a multi-million dollar studio. Maybe you want to get a couple placements. Maybe you want to run your own production company. Um, I don't know. You know what I mean? You need to find that out before you take these steps, cause you could you could go past success and not even know it and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? You know, so so have some type of goal the way you want to go and stuff. You know what I mean? Success to me is doing music what i love to do and being free you know what i'm saying help help make music make me free where i can do what i want when i want where i want you know what i'm saying that's my whole goal and shit i'm doing this shit independently like i'm running my own show my own company you know what i mean that's that's my whole definition set maybe yours is different i don't know if you want to share with that with me It'd be all good, you know what I mean? So, uh, yeah, that's number one. Number two is uh, perfect your craft, you know what I'm saying? Study, learn, research, 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 you know what I'm saying? You can never not learn enough, you know what I'm saying? You always want to keep on learning, you want to learn the newest software out there, uh, learn the newest, the newest sounds out here, what's the banging drums, so you get your shit banging, you know what I mean? You always want to learn about all of that stuff. You want to learn what um, instruments do. You know what I'm saying? Learn what uh, bass lines do. Learn what drum lines do. You know what strings do. You know what I mean? What a what a guitar riff do. What what elements it brings to your beats. You know what I mean? Uh, learn instruments. Uh, you want to learn a live instrument like a saxophone, the fuck uh, the violin, stuff like that. You know what I mean? I mean, I used to play instruments back in the day, like back when I was like in grade school and um, <clears throat> middle school. First, I started off playing the trumpet. I mean, so that, that introdu introduced me to music. You know what I mean, I got into middle school, I was playing the, the, the fucking viola and shit like that. You know what I mean? That <laughs> introduced me to music, how, you know, orchestra in this brand. So, like, I know how. How a band is ran, I know how orchestra is ran, you know what I mean? Like, I tapped into all of that. So, um, <clears throat> when I got into high school, you know what I'm saying? The hip hop thing, it took took over my life. It always been into my life, but that's why I wanted to get more involved with it, and stuff like that. And that's why I started getting into, into the beats, you know what I mean? Um, so a little story about me, but it's always want to perfect your craft. I listened to my beats back when I did back in early 2000s to what to now. You know what I'm saying, and I wouldn't know, or well, my beats wouldn't be nothing where they are now if what I didn't learn and what what knowledge I gathered to help create that whole thing, that whole style, and what I'm doing now, and stuff like that. <coughs> um, so number three. It gotta tie into last what I say is um crafting your style, crafting your sound. You know what I'm saying? You don't wanna be one of these cats out here imitating and copycatting, man. You, you dudes don't get too far. I don't know one dude out here doing anything copycat. You know what I mean? Like who? Let me know. Let me know right now. Alright, I figured that you yeah, I don't know. So you always wanna craft your sound, you know what I'm saying? If I find those sounds that you like. Shit, tweak them a little bit. Make them yours. Make them make them new special sounds that only you can do. If you chopping songs, chopping samples, chop them a certain way that only you can do. You know what I'm saying? If you got a certain drum pattern that you do, 
drum pad and that shit only something that you can do and shit like that it's all right to grab little stuff from uh producers let like influences from other producers but don't copy their style you just want to bring those little things into your beats just to you know you know expand your your, your beats and stuff like that but just don't copy man you know what i mean just don't do that shit you know what i mean that's a no no Alright, I'm on two. Alright, uh three. Three. Alright, um is no I'm on four. Yeah, I'm on four. Is uh networking. Networking, networking, networking. You know, this whole game is about building relationships. Not just online but offline. When you're online, make sure you know that you you interacting on your Facebook, your Twitter, your YouTubes, all your social media, you know, interacting with people. You know what I mean, just don't <clears throat> put stuff uh, or, or spam people links and shit like that. Cause that shit, I mean, I don't know one person that got on doing that shit. Y'all tell me one person. All right, I, I feel you. I don't know one person that does that shit. So, um, you, the people, you know, when you when you on social media, you want to interact. That's the whole thing. Interact with people. Let them know who you are. You know what I mean? And, and basically show them who you are you know what I mean be real with yourself you know what I'm saying that's the whole thing with social media the, when you real with yourself people are gonna come towards you because you know what I mean what the fuck you know what I mean that's you you know what I mean you, you, you're more you're more you're gonna get more more further being yourself than fucking trying to be somebody else and shit stop with all the gimmicks already man that shit cool out cool out with all that shit all right, so build a relationship, be with yourself. When you're offline, you know I mean, out in these streets, you got CDs, meeting people, um, keeping in contact, you know, with singers, rappers, um, musicians, people that play instruments, um, promoters, people that throw, uh, that uh, do venues, that uh, open venues up, um, people that shoot videos, you know, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Keep in contact with all those people because those people know people and those people can put you on the people. The next day you know you working with those people. If you if you understand what I'm saying. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um Yeah, so it's always good to network, network, network. You know what I'm saying? Always be able to and, and, and give back. You know what I'm saying? If you got people that you really you really cool with and working with. You know what I'm saying? And they and they help you bring the best out of you. you know what I'm saying? It's up right. Hit them off with a free beat or two. You know what I mean? Like yo, hey, it's off that. You know what I'm saying? Cause you know it's like it's just giving. You give them, they're gonna give you something back. You know what I'm saying? It's always something back in return and shit like that. So um we make beats like 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 nothing, you know what I mean? So it's alright to, to give here and there. It's alright to, you know do things for free here and there just know when and when not to do it shit like that so um yeah that's four all right five is um treating yourself like a business man marketing yourself uh coming up with a marketing plan to uh you know put your brand out here for instance you know uh i had a logo made for me for theme music productions um that like Whenever you see that logo, you think of me. Like if you don't know my, if you don't know, like <clears throat> my name, you know of the theme music thing. You're like, oh, that's the cat that's doing the beats. What's his name again? Yeah, yeah, oh yeah, Josh Lamont. It's, it's branded. You know what I'm saying? It's all about making a brand, making making your brand known. So every time somebody see that logo, they know, and yeah, that's the dude that make that make them beats, make them bangers and shit like that. You know what I mean? When you hear that theme music uh, tag of the of the chick in the in the, in the front of the beats, that's Brandon. You know what I'm saying? People know that. Like, oh, I right, I know this going to hear that theme music. Oh, it's, not, it's about to be a banger. You know what I mean? So it's all about marketing and putting yourself out there for the people. You know, getting uh, uh, promoting yourself right. You know. Um, Getting out on the YouTube, talking to people, um, 
people showing, uh, going out to venues, you know, looking professional. Maybe you want to have uh, some apparel on, you know, have like your your, your shirts on. Um, have on, uh, have your business cards ready, have your CDs ready, marketing yourself. Because when people see that you're professional and doing things professionally, they're gonna take you more serious. Like they, they gonna be like, yo, yo this dude, he ain't doing this shit for play, play. And I mean, he doing this shit for real. You know what I mean? Look, like, instance, business cards. You know what I'm Every time I'm out, we be giving business cards. I'm giving out CDs and shit. You know what I mean? I got CDs right here. I'm giving out CDs and some shit, you know what I mean? Like, that's the first take, by the way. But, um, yeah. So, like, there's some things that you need to keep in mind. Like, you know, first, you know, define what success is. Study your craft. You know what I'm saying? Network. You know, create your craft. You know what I mean? Know your sound. Create your sound. You know what I'm saying? Treat yourself like a business. You know what I mean? And if you just apply those things... You know what I'm saying? Gain more knowledge in them. You know what I mean? And uh, do that. You know what I'm saying? You're going to start seeing success come your way and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Just you got to apply yourself to this thing. You know what I mean? Um, so I hope y'all take this advice and uh, use it. Help y'all lead y'all way towards getting to y'all goals. You know what I mean? I'm trying to see everybody do their thing. You know, all the cats that I fuck with on the producer shit, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to do, see y'all do y'all thing. And uh, let's get right. Let's make these bangers out, alright? So it's Josh Lamont here. The Music Reduction. TheMusicPro.com is the website. Uh, the instrumental provider. Everybody needs theme music, alright? So holla at me. One.